Models. A design file is composed of one or more design, drawing, or sheet models. Models in the design file are similar to worksheets in the workbook of a spreadsheet. When geometry is created, it is added to the active model. A model can be either 2D or 3D and is stored as a discrete object in the design file. You can have an unlimited number of any model types in a DGN. While you work through the lessons in this course, you will learn Rename a model Adjust model properties Continuing in the design file Propose Site Plan DGN Along the ribbon, from the Home tab, in the Primary Ribbon group, pick Models Design files are composed of one or more models. Our design file contains a single design model. A model can be either 2D or 3D, with each model stored as a discrete object in the design file. When geometry is created, it is added to the active model. You can have an unlimited number of any model type in a DGN. There are three types of models. Design models. A design model can be either 2D or 3D, and is intended to store design geometry. MicroStation provides the ability to have an unlimited number of design models in a single DGN file. Drawing models. A drawing model is a subset of a design model that is typically used to apply annotations such as text, notes, and dimensions to embellish the design. And then sheet models. Sheet models are used for composing a finished sheet used for printing the design. It is possible for sheet models to be scaled or used at one-to-one. -one. In the models dialog, right-click on the model name. From here, pick Rename and change the name to Proposed Site Plan. Models also have other properties that may be viewed in the properties dialog. So with the Proposed Site Plan model highlighted, pick Edit Model Properties. The Properties dialog is opened with the model properties displayed. In the General Properties, go ahead now and change the following. For the Description, Propose Site Plan. And for the Annotation Scale, 1 inch equals 50 feet. These changes will take effect immediately. Continuing in the Properties, go ahead and scroll down locating angle readout. Here you can observe the values for direction base, direction mode, format, and accuracy that were set in the previous lesson. These settings are model specific settings and can also be set in the properties dialog. The settings for working units are also available. Go ahead now and take a moment to review the current working units settings. When finished, close Properties and the Models dialog. In this lesson, you learn the role of models and how they relate to MicroStation design files. Models can be either 2D or 3D, will be a design, drawing, or sheet model, and are stored as a discrete object within the design file. It is also possible to have an unlimited number of any model type in a DGN. During this lesson, you renamed a model, and adjusted the properties of a model. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.